What's up everybody? Welcome back to another Golden Life Bat Review. We're back here at Hunter Hobby Park in Riverside, California on another gloomy day here in January. We're still in January. Um, and yeah, we got a good one for you today. We're here with Alan. Alan, again, like in the last video, he's still recovering, but he's still looking good. Look at this guy, man. He's looking like he wasn't even sick. And you know, like I said before, all of us have been sick and dealing with life. So, um, you know, just we haven't been making a lot of videos, but we're back. We're going to get back into it and we're going to come back at you with another Onyx bat that we're going to be swinging today. And today we have the Onyx Toys for Kids. All right, so if you see there, it is a U-Triple Estate 240 stamp bat, two-piece composite. It's a 13 and a half inch barrel length. And this one is, surprisingly, this one's 28 ounces. Now, it doesn't feel too heavy like a 28 ounce, but it also does have a quarter ounce end load. Yes, you heard that right. It is a quarter ounce end load, the slightest end load, but hopefully it'll be, you know, keeping that barrel back just long enough so we can launch these balls out of the park. So the cool thing about this bat, aside from the color and the paint scheme, is that it features Onyx's 2024 new technology. Now, I don't know the exact specifics of the technology, but only thing I know is it's going to be hotter. It's going to be more competitive as far as with the, within the market of the USSA market. And yeah, man, we're excited to swing this one up. And also looking at the graphics here, we do see some holiday theme there. Now, we were meant to swing this one up for our Christmas video, um, but, but unfortunately, Alan did get sick. He couldn't make it. He was going to bring this one to us, and, but we made it work. So it is a little bit later into the year. We're in January now, but we're going to be swinging this holiday themed bat. But again, we're going to show you how well this one performs. And again, you might have seen when we did the firstborn, this was supposed to be better than the firstborn. So we're excited to swing this one up. Alan, this one's yours. Go ahead and pull it out of the wrapper, bro. Come on, Alan. Come on, man. All right, look at that matte finish. Damn. That it looks, as always, these bats look way better out of the wrapper. There goes the Toys for Kids. We got that little Santa right there. We got the holiday theme. Merry Christmas to everyone who we didn't say Merry Christmas to because, yeah, you know, if you made it this far into the year, it is no longer Christmas, but we don't care. We're going to swing this one up. We're excited. Alan, you're not going to swing because you're still sick, recovering. His wife will kill us if we let him swing, but it's all good. We're going to have fun with this. So let's hit it up. Let's go. Let's, let's go, go, Alan. Go, baby. Swing this. All right, here we go. I'm gonna take the first hatch with this one. Hopefully, like I said, it performs better than the firstborn because that's what we've heard through the grapevine. Let's see how it hits up. Alan, Alan's right there. You can't see him, but Alan, you ready to see how your bat performs? Let's go. Let's hit it can't up. Can't wait. Oh. Sounds a little different. It sounds way different, but you see that? Yeah. Wow, first hit. Got him. Man, these lines are feeling good so far. Wow. Oh! Okay. I see you. you Dude! Damn. Wow. There you go. There you go, Zach. He didn't want Ooh. that. <laughs> you hot, baby. So these lines are going pretty far as far as the way I hit, so I'm liking this one so far. Damn. Ooh. Fire. I like that line, man. Yeah. Wow. Damn. Wow, I like this. I like it a lot. Oh! This one's good, dude. I like it. <laughs> Alright, I got Alan here with me because he was sitting back here watching my swings. Matt, I think Ryan Vega said this one was hotter than the firstborn. Ryan, thank you for recommending this one to us. I have to agree. I have to agree. Again, I did really good with the first one for my first couple hits. This one, I felt like I did even better. The barrel, very stiff. Very stiff. So if you like the stiff barrel, it's going to be a good one for you. But I felt it loosening up as I was hitting. The handle feels amazing. Two-piece composite, um, no vibration. I did miss a couple of those hits that you didn't see because I didn't put it in. But regardless, no vibration. 13 and a half inch barrel length. I love the longer barrels. The knob feels great. And it doesn't feel like a 28. It feels more like a 27 um, with a little bit of an end load. For me, personally, I could have gone just a smidge lighter, but overall, if you work it, man, this one's going to be amazing. Overall, I think this one is going to be the best bat that we've swung so far this year. I know we, <laughs> we're not that far into the year, but so far, this is the top one. The top one so far. I like it. I, I wish I had it for myself. Man, Onyx, you did really good with this one. Alan, what would you think? You saw Sounds the hits. different from the firstborn. Um, man, I don't know. I like it. I can't wait to swing it. Yeah, so once he gets healthier, we're going to make sure that he swings it. But yeah, again, link in the description where you can find more information. We're not affiliated with Onyx, so uh, we're just trying to promote what we think is good. And this for sure is one. This is one toy that I wish I had. Toys for kids made me feel like a real kid today. So check him out. Link in the description. And let's go see how the next guy hits. Let's go. Smooth, smooth swing. 
All right, here we go. We got Jam and Jay up with this one. Jam and Jay, I know you like the heavier bass. I think you might like this one. Let's hit it up. Oh, boy, Jam and Jay. That sounds good. Deep. Solid sound on that bat, huh? All right. This guy feels really nice, dude. Okay. I got him. Bat does all the work. Out of Jay. Damn. You hit it farther than I did on my best shot. It's coming off hot. Like 30 feet away from that that came out fast. Come on, hot. End cap. That's why I like that field. 300. Oh, 25 feet. Oh, Dang. Dang, bro. That's still going back. Look at that. Damn. There you go. You got it. Wait, finish it. I know most people don't like 28 ounces, but I do. And it has a weight that is uh, just perfect for what I need. Every ball that I hit, that I got a hold of with this back came off really fast. I'll give this one a, a nine out of 10. Good bat. Okay. All right, we're gonna throw everybody on this bat today because we got Pablo here. We're gonna show you different swing styles. Man, this bat so far has been doing good. Let's see how Pablo does. Oh, there you go. Look, Marcus just looked at it. He wasn't ready. Dude, that was a shot. Yeah. Our radar. Oh, okay. oh, that okay. sounds nice. There you go. Meaning everything with this one. Yeah. So fair. Oh, Beautiful. Oh, nice. Still got it. He said, he, 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 said he golfed. He wasn't ready. It's for the kids. Nice bat. Let's get it. All right, here we go. We got Zach going on. We're going to have uh, uh, the radar going on as well. So Zach thinks he can hit over 90. I don't uh, think so. We'll hear it for sure. I don't know if I can. I just want to. Let's go, Zach. Hit it up. 84 miles per hour. First hit, not bad. 78 miles per hour. Oh my gosh. Oh, one off. 82 miles per hour. Wow. Dude, that went over. It hopped over, but it went over. 76 miles per hour. Okay, 90. Hey, Zach, if you hit one over 90, I will Venmo you $10 and buy half meal. 78 miles per hour. That was way faster. 81 miles Ooh, per hour. 89 miles per oh, hour. Oh, 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 Get that phone ready. Ah. 75 miles oh, per hour. Wrong way, but I like that hit though. Wow. 73 miles per hour. What? Wow. 89 miles Whoa. per hour. Oh, you got it, Zach. Come on. 82 miles per hour. Ooh, that's a good shot, nice, too, dude. Wow. 84 miles Ooh. per hour. Come on, can you got this squared up? 71 miles per hour. Is that out? No. Dude, that's out there, though. 83 miles Ooh, per hour. Yeah, that's a good that shot, nice too. Wow. Oh. That was nice. Hey, you got 89. All right, Zach. No Happy Meal, no $10, but you almost hit 90. <laughs> and you're shooting them over pretty good, man. I don't know, man. This bat is definitely better than the other Onyx we swung. But I thought I was going to clear 90 a lot, a lot easier than that. But those balls were flying, so better pick up than the other one. It's a good toy. All right, we got Marcus going up. I think Marcus is going to hit 90s easy with this bat, um, but we have to deal with some background noise. Unfortunately, there's construction going on. But let's see how Marcus does regardless. Let's go, Marcus. 79 miles per hour. That's a good shot. 
85 miles per hour. Nice liner. 84 miles per hour. Wow. Marcus, I'll make you the same deal, brother. Line, 10 boy. bucks if you hit 90 plus. 78 miles per hour. Ooh, that's a shot. Yeah, this bad is nice. 66 miles per hour. Mark, did you catch it? That's going out. Yeah. 80 miles per Ooh, hour. That, that looked like it was more than 80. 78 miles per hour. Is that gone? 65 miles per hour. You're almost there. You catch it right there and it's gone. 88 miles oh! per hour. <laughs> 78 miles per hour. Yeah, that one looked like it came off slower, but it was out there. Classic. 72 miles per hour. There you go. 84 well, miles per hour. That's out. Yeah. Oh my. Atta boy! Wow. 33 miles per hour. <laughs> yeah. Atta boy, look That's at the boy out there. 73 Marcus. miles per hour. You got one, kid. I'd say a uh, good bet. Um, technology is definitely there and uh, definitely keeping up with uh, Louisville. Way to go, Alex. Alright everybody, that's going to do it here for us at Hunter Hobby Park in Riverside, California. We're trying to rush this outro because it's starting to rain on us. You see the bats a little bit wet, those balls were poofing water. Yeah, we don't want to ruin our camera. So, overall, man, this one was amazing. Alan, you got a good one here. I think once it is fully broken in, this one's going to be shooting lasers upon lasers. and. Like everyone's saying, man, this is a good competitor for the Louisville market, the 2024 technology that Onyx is coming out with, with these new upcoming bats that you can find in this bat. Definitely, definitely one that you need to try. So definitely check them out. We'll put a link in the description. And again, we're not sponsored, but we'll put a link in the description where you can get more information on these bats and uh, possibly get your own. Um, but definitely pick one up if you can, because uh, like I said, holiday themed, but it doesn't mean you can't swing it all year round. So it's a good one. Onyx, you did very good with this one. And uh, Ryan Vega, thank you so much for recommending this one to us, because this one was super fun to swing. And I know some of you are going to be asking how they compare to each other, but by far, this one is the superior bat between the Firstborn and the Toys for Kids. Um, I think we all came to that conclusion, and again, Ryan Vega was right about this one, so again, thank you for recommending this one. And yeah, man, like I said, definitely try it out. Like, comment, subscribe if you made it this far into the video. Um, let us know how you think we all swung with this one and if you think it's going to be a good one for you. Because like we always say, we're just a bunch of average Joes here. We're not conference players. We're not big time players. We just like to show you how these bats perform for us regular folk who, uh, you know, can use a little bit of extra power with these bats. So definitely check it out. Like, comment, subscribe. All that good stuff. And we'll see you in the next review. Deuces.